seven of wands too much competition that you need to fight right now probably guarding your position something's come full circle probably the job or the business that you're pursuing right it's completed a circle here your blockage is to change the job or to leave or there's like this huge shake up and you need to let go of the stability of the shop of this job that you're at the business that you're looking at but you choose to remain guarded <clears throat> you choose to remain in that resistance mode is what i'm getting you know that things uh, there's no more learning to do okay in the current job that you're at you're done learning whatever you had to yeah so i feel that you've already had a very fulfilling career path you you've completed this entire cycle at this current business you're ready to move forward okay you're ready to move into something new or move something new within this business or this career probably move to a new position or something your biggest challenge out here is that you're resisting change because this change is going to be something that's going to push you out of your comfort zone and that's what you're resisting see in the past here you were already a little passive when it came to you, when it came to your actions on your mind you still miss the same work you know you probably want to go back to what you were always doing with the six of cups you know or uh, the six of cups is the energy of course like you know right it's it's going back revisiting the past okay going back to what you felt was um, a good job okay but uh, i think you do definitely um, probably a staying in a stale job right now okay probably even repeating negative uh, patterns of some sort but on your mind you want to go back to something and not repeat your past mistakes okay maybe you've learned your lessons out here queen of cups you want, now i'm getting that now probably you're wanting to pursue a career which is a very balanced career okay you're probably wanting not only something that gives you financial stability but something that is emotionally very fulfilling to you you know something that gives uh, you uh, a lot of support but again something that needs emotional fulfillment along with financial stability and that's the root of the issue here maybe the past that what you whatever you were doing that gave you a, a mixture a balance of both and you're resisting a change right now okay because this is a huge shake up that you're resisting a disaster in the near future you could be having some kind of investors that are coming in to join you okay the 6 of pentacles is a good card when it comes to business this is investors this is uh, you could probably be a very valued employee within your business okay but there's definitely a mentor or someone who's going to come in and give you that helping hand financially okay definitely someone here to guide you out seven of swords in reverse you're wanting to change your approach maybe okay it doesn't have to be for everyone but uh, this also means that earlier probably there was a lot of um, <clears throat> a lot of shady business deals a lot of fraud a lot of scams whatever you could be involved in something like that but now this time i think that you're wanting to change your approach okay because you already got the consequences of your actions and you're wanting to change your approach and you're wanting like i said right with this with the queen of cups are you wanting to do something not only which had money maybe you were pursuing a career which only give you the money only the stability but when it came to making you happy nada this time you're wanting to change your approach and you're wanting to do something that is giving you that um emotional happiness and you're ready to <laughs> change your ways the sun in reverse here i think you have unrealistic expectations about something the sun in reverse can also be an unrealistic expectations this is also being a little overconfident about something okay but uh, maybe there is someone around you who is uh, failing to appreciate you at work or you're just feeling that you know the people don't appreciate you for the work that you do etc or this is just you who has some kind of unrealistic expectations probably you're more ego based okay this is more ego based uh, situation five of swords in your emotions you feel the need to stand up for yourself either you're going to walk away from a lot of mind games okay but with the 7 of wands and the 5 of swords here this tells me that there's something that you need to face your challenge but there's some kind of competition that you need to fight off okay 7 of wands is facing competition facing challenges or trying to hold your position okay against your competitors or probably even or fighting to stay you built something very stable and you're trying to hold your ground okay and with the 5 of swords in your emotions here i think you're good <laughs> 
sorry but the fire will surge in uh, out here in your emotions i feel that you want to walk away from anything that is messy you want to uh, literally like you know you literally want to walk away from something that's creating a lot of stress tension and arguments probably there's harassment or there's just a lot of hostility at work you know due to poor communication or lack of communication but you want you feel the need to walk away because you don't want to do what you've been doing all this while okay you're trying to change your approach you're guilty about something and you're wanting to uh, rectify situation and turn a new leaf four of pentacles i think you're still going to hold on you're still going to continue to hold on to something that you hold as uh, that you uh, feel is very very valuable to you okay you're still in that little paranoia mode you know with the outcome here <coughs> that's what's happening that's what's happened the tower here you're resisting that so like i said like i said like the four of pentacles as your likely outcome i feel you're still going to hold on to a job or a business right that doesn't fulfill you but you're holding on to it because you're feared losing the financial security that it's giving you that's what's happening you're still going to continue it you know it's like you're very contradicted what you're doing right now is you want a turn on your leave okay you want to try something very differently you don't want to do those thefts scams you don't want any shortcut to any money etc but again emotionally you feel the need uh to again there's this very uh, there's a lot of defensiveness in your emotions that aggressiveness sometimes maybe there is nothing really bad around you in your environment it's your attitude that makes you feel that there is something around you where you need to feel defensive so need to check about the way you're viewing the situation around you okay clap at the same time clap at the same time page of wands you want to pursue something new okay there's some new adventure new risk that you want to do this is something um the page of wands is probably a new position or a new project okay you wanted to take a risk at work but again with the seven of wands and the page of wands it's it's probably literally saying that you want to fight for something new okay <coughs> it's on your mind this is on your mind okay you definitely want to and i think you're wanting to stick to it and no matter what happens you're ready to fight it off yeah you're holding your ground you know like that's what i said you you're probably wanting to face the challenges anything that it takes you know but you want something new you want this new project this new idea that you have in mind you definitely want to uh, want to let it come to fruition and you will do anything and everything that it takes you know to keep it at bay and what you're currently doing right now either you finish you come full circle with the current job or the business that you're in and you're moving to something new or this is the current career that you're pursuing and you want to sh shift to a brand new uh, position anything could involve traveling whatever you're doing it could involve traveling okay long distance or whatever what's the tower why is the tower here what is the tower maybe you are very scared that if you try to pursue something new all of a sudden it's going to have this huge shake up you know within your family situation maybe you're the bread owner of the family and maybe you feel that if you try to shift somewhere you know all of a sudden there could be a lot of uh, conflicts you know at home probably this could create a lot of workplace conflicts between your colleagues okay right now probably you're the one who supports your family and this shake up or whatever this is right or oh, that sudden unexpected change and um put you in a spot where your family with your say your finances could be very unstable okay or uh, you're the only one and uh, who supports your family like i said or your loved ones and then the entire thing could be a big burden on you you know that's why probably you're avoiding this new change <coughs> what's the six of cups on your mind what's the six of cups What is this on your mind? The judgment in reverse here. There's this calling that you're ignoring over and over again. Maybe, maybe there is this calling where you need to go back to something that you worked previously. Okay, there's something. The judgment in reverse is where you are literally avoiding or ignoring a calling. Okay, you're. Um, there's this lack of realization. You're in denial of a situation, or denial in in of of some truth. Okay, 
<coughs> you're probably doubting your abilities. That's what I'm getting. You know that you want to go back to how good things were, probably in your past work or past job, whatever. You that calling is coming into you again and again, okay? But you're refusing to hear it. You're refusing to hear it. That acceptance and awareness of the situation, okay, or of your actions is not coming in. You're still not awakening from your sleep. You're still choosing to repeat that negative cycle, okay? You're still not ready to break that cycle only because you're refusing this disaster here. Only because you're refusing this disaster here. You're not even happy. You know what you want to pursue, but you're staying very closed off to that idea. Uh, what's, the, uh, what's the Queen of Cups? See? You want to pursue something, okay, that makes you happy with the star here. That's like a wish fulfillment. But along with that, you want to pursue something where there are you have very, very high hopes about your job or high hopes about this new thing that you want to pursue with the page of wands here. There is something that you really want to pursue. You have a lot of faith and hope that will work out. You have a lot of positivity, okay, about the, that connection, uh, about that situation or what you want to pursue. But... This is your major challenge here. You have to let the tower fall. You have to let something happen. <coughs> Why the seven of swords in reverse? Three of swords. See, you're changing your approach because now you want to explore your options. You know, I'm literally getting some of you who's like very, very serious about exploring their options. You want to, you know, expand your career options. Okay. And you probably even want a new horizons in your career, whatever. There could have been obstacles in the path earlier. You know, you could have felt very caged within this situation here, but now you're ready to grow. And your way is you're wanting to do it very, very strategically. And in a new way. What's the sun in your voice? You're going to get help regardless in the near future. Either this is a partnership, not very much, but definitely some older person who's very generous with their money. Either they're going to help you out financially, you're going to get a good mentor, or there's just someone here who's going to give you uh, a, a good investor. You're going to get a good investor in the near future. See, lack of passion, right? Unrealistic goals is what I'm getting. So I feel there is a lack of progress in your environment because you have unrealistic expectations, which in turn is making you feel very uninspired. You're lacking that inspiration and feeling very uncreative at work. There's a lack of progress here. Maybe you need to make your expectations a little more real, okay? Tweak your expectations. So it's good to have hope. It's, to, it's good to be positive. But see to it that along with being positive, you're even being realistic. What's the five of swords? Yeah, Ace of Cups. Yes. You want something. You want something that, you know, fulfills you. You're very bored right now. Wherever you are, you know. See, wherever you are right now, right? I mean, I think either you're very bored, you're feeling very unmotivated, or there's just very unfriendly environment, a very hostile environment. And you feel the need to constantly stand up for yourself. All right. Or probably even walk away because you're looking for something which gives you, um, uh, you know, you want those new emotions at job. You want that creativity. You want something basically that makes you very happy and emotionally fulfilled. Right. Look with the Queen of Cups. That's the reason for the reading. Right. And that's what's going on with your emotions. I think you're ready to walk away emotionally. You're ready to walk away from the situation because probably the job that you're at, either the environment is nasty. It's full of stress, tension, conflicts. Bad communication, hostile environment, you know, constantly playing mind games, underhanded behavior, you know, uh, uh, some kind of abuse, etc. And you're like, you know what? No more. I want to turn a new leaf. That's what you're doing. But in your environment, something's still not picking up because you're not getting that motivation to stop that again. You know, only because you want to stay in a job that's very uh, secure right now. See, that's why you're still holding on to it with the four of pentacles. This is the outcome because you're not taking that action yet. <clears throat> What's the four of pentacles? Why the four of pentacles? Why the five? four of pentacles? The moon in reverse here. There is no clarity at work. I think that you have an opportunity. But I have a feeling that you're sabotaging this. You're sabotaging this opportunity that you're still getting. Because the moon is also... Um, it is releasing stress, fear, anxiety, but the moon is also sabotage at work, okay? It's where you know something uh, can happen. It can work out for you. 
but you're still trying to you know work around with that you don't have clarity about what you want you're sticking to this and you're sabotaging your own opportunity you will get something very good in the near future your it's your wish fulfillment but the thing is that you need to tweak your goals a little bit you do till you don't tweak your goals you're all constantly going to keep having this false start you know maybe you're approaching the kind of people without doing your research or maybe what again i cannot stress enough unrealistic expectations okay being positive is not a bad thing it's a good thing but be positive and have expectations that are within your reach okay because otherwise you're reaching for something too far and when you know either you get demotivated because it takes too t- too long for you to reach there or that goal is so far fetched that you just give up before even trying okay and you start you stop you start you stop fall starts that's what i'm saying and ultimately you're sabotaging this okay you're sabotaging this you need to get more clarity at what you want to do and how you want to do it walk around your goals see that what you want is realistic and see that what you want is down in pen and paper and make a plan get have more structure the willingness is there the action is there but your goals probably just need to be tweaked yeah So that's what I have for you Taurus. I hope this reading resonates with you. Like, share, subscribe and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.